Hello everybody, it's Boaz Fahler and this is the Daily Astrology Forecast for September 11, 2016. So, what a date. I still remember the time in which I was uh, in New York, in Manhattan. It was September 11, 2001 or 2000. I don't remember if it was 2001 or 2000. I think it was 2000. And I was heading to the UN for a conference I was taking part in. I was watching the news and I saw the first plane going into the World Trade Center. Being an Israeli, I already immediately thought this is a terrorist attack and I prepared myself to go and donate blood, something I was used to from suicide bombs happening in Israel. And I drank my coffee and I went downstairs to the blood center. They told me they don't have any shortage of my blood, so they didn't need my blood. And yes, a couple of hours later, it was apparent that this was a terrorist attack once the second plane came in. And these were amazing days for me to be in New York, in Manhattan, and feel the vibe, feel the vibe of all the people in the city and how it changed the city. And for me, it was amazing to see how an older colored woman could talk to a younger uh, a boy from a different ethnicity in the subway without any fear, just sharing experiences. That suddenly people started working together, understanding they're in the same plight together, they're in the same boat. And just fear dissolved, uh, fear dissolved and the sense of community heightened. And in the days after that, I was volunteering in the Red Cross shelter that was set up and it was just amazing and for me these were days that I'll always remember and yes it was a horrible tragedy but what I do remember most from these days is the spirit of the people of America and the spirit of the people of New York and that's something that strengthened me and changed the way I feel towards America and made me love it even more than I did before and would go with me for the rest of my days so back to today. The moon is in Capricorn, it sextiles Neptune in the morning. That could be a great mix between doing things that are work-related and career-related and har harnessing uh, imagination and the muses to really bring things from the future to the reality, to daily reality. Then there are beautiful aspects to the nodes and then the Moon conjuncts Pluto squaring Venus at around 1700 hours Central European time, that's around 12 noon time Eastern Standard Time. This is a really sensitive day for relationships. You really have to make sure that we don't get into conflicts and fights in relationships. And take the fact that Venus is being squared by Pluto as well. These changes, if they do occur, can be intense and can be long lasting. So. It is a time to be truthful in your relationships. It is a time to bring from the darkness to the light issues that need to be dealt with, but we need to be very wise regarding how we do it. Um, and not be overly dramatic and not be over emotional and just re keep it in, a, in, a, in the right mind, in a sense. Venus, uh, I'm sorry, the Sun is querying Mars exactly today which means this is a day that we really need to pay attention not to go into conflicts and fights with other people and to make sure uh, we're safe and watch from accidents at home, at work, or on the road. So, that's it for today. I hope you're going to have a wonderful week ahead and thank you for listening. And if you want co private consultations or studying astrology with me, you can contact me through the details on the slide at the end of the video. This is Was Fanner. Goodbye.